People gathered at Stern Center Gardens for People Against Rape's 25th annual Take Back the Night. Since 1974, People Against Rape has grown to serve child and adult victims of sexual violence and abuse. I caught up with Dr. Vaughn Bacanic, who gave us more information on the event. Take Back the Night uh, started in a variety of places. There's lots of different stories about how it began, but it is basically a... Uh, celebration of uh, people who have become survivors of violence and sexual assault. We want to take back the night to make it a safe place for pre people to be after dark and during the day, uh, but particularly we're worried about uh, people who go out on the streets at night and are subject to mugging and assault and sexual assault. Other local nonprofit organizations came out to support the event as well. One staff member who works for People Against Rape tells us more about what the organization does for our community. We provide victim advocacy. We help with um, court. We also network with nonprofit organization, other nonprofit organizations. Um, if they want someone to go to court with them, explain the court proceedings. If they need counseling, um, if they just want to talk because they're having a bad day, um, anything. We provide therapy. We provide just a host of different things. For more information on Take Back the Night, visit peopleagainstrape.org. For CTV News, I'm Kristen Robertson.